All right, you guys, so it is 10 degrees here in Illinois. And so I'm not going anywhere. So I think we're gonna do a full day clean with me, maybe a little bit of mom life. I have to clean the main level of the house, get our guest room ready. So stay tuned for that. Or if it's already posted, who knows? Um, but yeah, so today we're gonna do a full day clean with me, living room, dining room, kitchen, guest room, maybe a bathroom, who knows? Let's see how far I get. I have until two o'clock, and so that gives me about like four hours. So, so join me today, and maybe it'll motivate you, or put this on while you clean your house, and you can see how much you get done. So, all right, you guys, let's clean. good it polishes it and cleans it so I saw this from another mommy blogger and I really love it and it works really good so and I use it on top of um, my oven and it made it nice and shiny too so find this definitely pick it up it's, it's a good little good little clean supply are pretty but they are impossible to keep clean for us at least in our house. Look like. mm. So good. 
laundry I had to fold and get done. Um, I usually have my boys put away all of their laundry. I don't have a problem folding them because I'm particular about how I want it and that's just me. But I will fold and get everything hung for them and I will just have them go put away their laundry. Easy peasy chore for the kids to do. going to be mopping with Bona wood floor cleaner. I prefer this. Um, I It is pet friendly. My dog lifts the floor all the time so I have to have it pet friendly and it also doesn't leave a film like some other brands so I highly recommend the Bona. You also get to reuse the pads which I like a lot too. So.
Does anyone else get a ton of just paper from the your kids' schools? I feel like we get so much paper, like classwork or anything like that, and it all ends up going into the recycling. It makes me insane how much paper that we're constantly having to deal with. I wish there was a better way to like deal with it. Like all of this paper, that's all kids' schoolwork. It's crazy. Crazy.
So this is a toy closet that we have and I also put like candles and even Christmas gifts that we haven't even opened yet. So I'm going to organize all of this. I don't know how much I'll film because it takes a really long time to organize all of this. This just got, got out of control so it's okay. Life happens. So does anyone else just like not give all of their kids their Christmas gifts and just kind of use it on like a rainy day? Because we do. And Bentley and Riker even have some gifts that are in their room, in their closets that they haven't even opened yet. So I'm going to try to get rid of all these tchotchkes and organize all of this. The baby stuff is because I have a... I have three little nieces that come to visit, like for holidays or parties, so I like to have um, entertainment out for them. So that's why there's baby stuff, no babies for us right now. Oh goodness. I already started taking some of it out. My cleaning pile. A million times better I got all of the boys unopened Christmas like gifts from last year so those are that's in a bin like the smaller items are in a bin boxes cleaned a whole bunch of stuff out have some baby items for my nieces paperwork stuff for myself so happy with how this turned out we got rid of here we got rid of this whole basket and then two Trader Joe's bags full of just unopened little tchotchkes and just crap so so happy with how that looked it feels so good to be getting rid of a lot of things and clutter especially with the um, holidays coming up and just to kind of see what the boys actually do have so it feels really good to get all of it organized I may have to organize the boys room soon is that a video that you guys would like to see how I do their closets and deep cleaning their room desk. it is as clean as the desk will get Kyle is in the middle of a bunch of paperwork, so he's dealing with that, so I have to kind of keep that out, so. And then we also have the boys' homework that needs to be done out, but a million times better. Before, you couldn't even see. Mixed bed is nice and clean. There's part of my vacuum. Um, but this area is just so much more clean, and you actually want to be over here, so. A million times better. Minecraft, of course, for all you moms out there with boys or girls that like Minecraft. My one is completely obsessed. <sighs> Feels so good. And seriously, the amount of just toys that we're getting rid of is insane. It's kind of like our little library where the, and the dogs keep their toys and stuff. So reorganized that, dusted it. The books right here are kind of what the boys are gravitating towards these days so we just keep that out so and then in a little while we will um, cycle out some more books into it Make
right, so we are all done cleaning. It took a week. But we're ready for Thanksgiving, we're ready for our guests. Lots of work. And you know what, moms and working people, it is completely okay to not get all your cleaning done in one day. This may only last for 10 minutes, so enjoy it while we can. My to-do list, things are getting checked off. Dining room is ready. whenever my men get home I'm enjoying it while I can the entertainment needed or the entertainment center need to be cleaned out so a lot better changed out a few of the books got rid of a few things organized the games so I think we moved it because we were playing hide and go seek in the house and the boys could fit underneath and a little too involved in that game. Everything is clean and dusted. Just got to maintain. And then my new little bar card I redid. You saw on my Instagram, you'd see the before and after, but I'm happy with how it came out. It's cute, and especially for the holidays whenever you have people over. Plus, I've always wanted one. This couch is my Everest. Rosie!